Hello, my fellow hound dogs, and welcome back to Stellaris. If I remember correctly, last episode we had won a war against our foes. Now, it might not be a total victory, but it's a first step in our long and arduous mission to protect humanity. It's humanity number one. Um, yeah, if I remember correctly, we were going ahead and having people research different things at different archaeological sites, just so that way we would have... Um, We'd have kind of a feel for, we would get like artifacts, have a feel for the area, etc, etc. But, we should be okay to continue putting claims in. Now, if I remember correctly, I was looking at this spot right here. I was looking at them because I kind of either want to be friends with them or I want to take them over. Depending upon if they are, actually, you know, I will establish an embassy for right now. And, uh, oh, they're in a federation. Hey, they're already at war with an unidentified empire. Let's build a spy network then. Yeah, let's build a spy network then. Let's get, let's gather some information because we're gonna need it. That being said, science ship reports enemy contact. Woo. Okay. Well, before I was gonna say something before this happened, but I will let it uh, sit right here for a second. Um. Okay, so before we get started, uh, just to kind of clarify, if you like this video, leave a like. Let me know what you think of the video down below in the comment section. I greatly appreciate it. And uh, yeah, with that, let's let's continue. I wasn't expecting that. That's why it kind of threw me off guard a little bit. Okay. Um, oh, it's the uh, it's the Leviathan. It's the Leviathan. It is the Leviathan. I don't know how the hell that's gonna work with. That's gonna be a. Uh, oh, it's a guardian dragon? It seems we have finally had the displeasure of meeting. So the dragon must have been attracted by. Perhaps she was. Cited a spaceborne life form. Spaceport reports enemy contact. Spaceport lost to enemy action. Holy Special project crap. complete. Well, I guess we don't own this system anymore. Uh, well, it only provided five energy, which is not terrible. I will... Wait, build up a fleet, and uh, screw you up, dragon thing. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do... I like the enthusiasm with this. But I'm gonna need anchorage, and anchorage, just to get fleet capacity up again. And then I'm gonna do an anchorage, anchorage, and then the two. So I'm gonna do defenses. So 
I got three defense platforms being built, which is nice on that one. I've got four on the other one, which is good. And do I need anything over here? Let's just have an empty space. Why, oh, there's two empty spaces. Which one is this? Was this one of ours before the war, or what, which one was this? There it is. Nice. Um, more anchorage, please. I don't anticipate you seeing any sort of like combat anytime soon. Probably most famous last words ever, but we've established an embassy. We've decided to have friendly relations with these people. Um, I do say that I kind of want to start a war with these people then. If we're going to have our friendly relations with one, I want to destroy the other. Battle debris secured. Science division reports a new breakthrough. They're openly hostile with me. Like, how much more bad relations do I need to declare them my rival? I can do mega foundries, or I can do swarm missiles. And mega foundries. Let's do that. Now that we are out of production. Or now that we are out of war, I should say not out of production. Now that we are out of war, we should be focusing on our production. And getting everything prepared for the next round. Because I have a feeling that this little tenuous piece is not going to last forever. Because mostly I will start over the war. Mm. But I'm going to do that one. That one, just to kind of round off that corner. Hit that one up. And then that one. That'll be it for right now. That's the life. Who the hell is Orient Prime? Okay, then. Varan Regime? Which one is the Varan Regime? All the way over there? Operatives... Uncovered some that evidence will deceive us in the near future. Not be tolerated. It will not be tolerated. I'll get at least some planes in on you too. Since I'm sitting over here. Might as well take that entire corner. Let's do that. Cool. I got my next war. <laughs> got my next war lined up. That sounds very morbid. Hey, honey, I've got my next war lined up. Battle debris secured. Go ahead and fill your shipyard stuff up. You go over here. Don't try not to bankrupt my economy when you fly through space, please. Both of you go through here, because I can just use both of you to establish law and order. And then here, defenses. Don't need that. I need the um, people that are sitting on the planet. I need the armies, recruit. But I want the... What? They were so powerful before. What the hell happened? Eh, yeah, well... And well, I guess it just shows humanity's superiority. <clears throat> no. Um, just, let's see. Let's take our army off this world. Embark all. Let's go ahead and replace that with an... Oh. That's cool. That looks cool. Uh, precinct house, please. And then let's do, yeah, let's definitely get law and order set up so that way we can go ahead and Science Division report success. Cool, regenerative hull plating, which is nice. That's actually what we really need. Let's get some clear tile blocker stuff, because I know that we're going to need it later, too. We 
should honestly, we should have upgrades that need to, yeah, let's just do upgrades first, and then we'll launch an invasion, because why not? Um, because they can only hit me from right here. That's the only spot that I know of that they can hit me, unless there's like some workaround right over here that I don't know about, but... As I'm actively building a defense platform just to make sure that there isn't an avenue there that they can hit me from. it's probably more expensive in the long run doing it that way but in all honesty I'd rather have that than I have it at all battle so, debris secured see, orbital bombardment damage or exhaustion gain minus 25% especially when we be wartime we might as well council agenda ready upkeep naval capacity let's do that upkeep and naval capacity is definitely where I'm going to want um, ooh, wait what is this Cancel agenda ready. Power protection. Okay, cool. Start. Go explore over there. See if there's any sort of way that they're going to come over and try and get me. 62% complete! Yay! Oh, I just popped my neck and felt amazing! Let's see, elusive prime, what do you need? Ships refitted. What do you need? Got what I need. Let's throw out these tile blockers. And we'll come back and take a look at it. Then we will come back and take a look. Take a look, see? Okay, I'm gonna need the exotic gases and the volatile. Let's do this. We're setting it up now. Why not? We need the volatile. Do that. Let's do. Ships refitted. Go ahead and get some crystal production here. Go ahead and get To democracy. No, I why you will fall. Okay. Let's get this. Get you guys over there. Get you guys in a different star system, please. Just a little bit of ways away because we don't want that to. Don't want that to get. 
hand. Do not be true to the first wave. I should have invested in Spider Oh Unknown, unknown, let's see. Build a spy network, let's take you. Because we're gonna be friends with people. Let's take you, let's see. How are they, by the way? Are they like about the same level as probably? Oh, they are not they are not equivalent to us at all. Like we are the dominant power in our region, which is good. Because we just kick the crap out of them in a war. We kick Science the crap division out of reports them, a new breakthrough. Both, uh, economically and in fleet cap. So that's the total number that we can build. We are also on par with most people technology technology wide, I should say. What? Science Division cool. reports a new breakthrough. Frickety fracking. Err, grumble. Archaeological <laughs> okay. okay. System pause, reconnaissance pause, 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 completed. Pause, 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 pause. Darn you. Great deal of trial and error, a breakthrough has been made. Scion, gifted race, discovered dimension. Once the Zion population reached critical mass, it seemed that their collective unconscious minds began to make contact with Proto Shroud. And so found that they. Reality using their psionic powers, it wasn't long before they even discovered that they could physically enter the shroud and the like gods, transforming the dimension. And there, with no information on what happened to the inhabitants of Terra Prime, but while there are no answers here, we have learned of another Zindi colony which we have complete archive. <laughs> Allowing them to manipulate reality around them, are you kidding me? Let's see, let's go to the situation one. I think it's right. You hear them? Yeah, is that the site right there? Okay, let's do it. For science sake, exploration. You, hello! My science ship, how are you doing? Yeah, excavate this site. I'm gonna have to take out that darn dragon at some point. the game, please, and then Okay, please, thank you. Also, doing things like this is kind of a, a slow process, but it, it does get me there. You know what I mean? It makes sure that I can look at everything. Hold on, so I need this. Ships refitted. Mm -hmm. 
Skywatch has sighted a spaceborne life form. God, how many freaks? Science ship are there? lost with well, all hands. Guess I don't have to worry about that leader uh, cap anymore. Uh, yeah, no. Should be a. I want more information on this before I'm even willing to consider. Before I'm even willing to like construction toss complete out the idea of invasion. Science Division reports a new breakthrough. Invade, I really do, but I don't want to be foolish and just charge in out of nowhere because I'm an idiot. I can't invade them until what? Not. I can't invade them until 2260. So I got at least a couple more years on me before I can go ahead and do that. thinking. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. I'm gonna Leroy Jenkins it. Oh, why do I feel like this is gonna be bad? This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be bad. Permanent communications have been established with an alien empire. Cool, thank you. Keep it out of our way. Let's go. Invade. 
do it for the Emperor! For the Empire! For the Empire! Come on, get there. There's 254 power stars in the place. Ships refitted. Good. Continue the conflict. Ships refitted. <laughs> Engaging enemy station. <laughs> Begin the end of my pitiful nation? Are you kidding me? If anything, I'm gonna come out on top on this one. Humanity number one. Fleet action underway. Hold on. Stop the war for a second. I need to read. Huh. There must have been like a war or something, right? I kind of figured. Engaging enemy station. Let's go back to the shipyard. Repairs, then turn around and then take that one. You, I tried to keep right over here. What's hilarious is that they're inferior in economy. We don't know their fleet power, which, judging by what they just threw at me, I'm assuming that it's not as much as my own. Not trying to be cocky, just trying to make an observation. Let's see. Get those repairs, please. And then what? Engaging enemy station. Beautiful. You're all finished. You can go over here. Oh 
one of my ships lost its shields in that entire fight on this one. Jeez. Which is good. I feel like it's off the boot again. Get 2,000 minerals for this. Is nice. So we know he has a place to work. Yeah. Considering that fleet that they've got sitting over here, considering that they have like this sitting right here, I'm assuming that their economy and that their... Not just their economy, but like their fleet power is just not going to be anywhere close to mine. Because I literally just decked whatever 2k fleet that they just sent after me. I like how they upgraded this one though. They know. They know for a fact that this is going to happen at some point. They, they know that this is going to happen. Anyway. I can send one fleet over there. That's not going to hurt. Take that too. Keep the territory I wanted right off the bat, actually. This video might run a little long just because I want to kind of finish up this little battle right over here real quick. You think that 400 fleet action underway? Fleet power little thing of Corvettes is going to stop me? No. Nope. I will let you know that one right now. You are not going to stop me. There's one ship gone, there's another ship gone, and the third ship gone. Beautiful. Well, that's a 1.5k- Hey, that's the fleet that I faced earlier! How's it going? They're gonna die. Engaging enemy station. Oh, they got one destroyer, finally. They've got one destroyer. They're freaking destroyers then. Their Corvettes are dying. They are nowhere near the car, and especially if they're economically bankrupt. Like, if they are economically broke, right? Like, like if they are economically broke. Fleet action underway. This continued feeding that I am giving them will, like, is not going to be good for their economy. That's their home world, isn't it? That's their home world. <laughs> Isn't that? I think that's what that means, doesn't it? All right. All right. What the hell? I'll I'll invade their home world. All right. Don't have to pull my leg twice. All right, I'll do this one last little maneuver, and then, then I'm ending it. Then I'm ending the video. Should be pretty darn close to jumping right now. Science Division reports a new breakthrough. Good. What is it? Ooh, cold fusion engines. That's good. I think I'm gonna do Engaging enemy station. that.
is that? That's my question. What the hell is that? Will it attack me? I don't believe... Let's see, wait, does this... Oh, the castle it has a castle next to it, which means it won't attack me. <laughs> as long as I don't attack them, they won't attack me. Lovely. Oh, they're already coming to me with that 1.8k fleet. Okay. Oh, bullshit. Fleet action underway. I love how I warp right into them, and they're like, "Oh shit!" and they're running away. Come and kill Cool, we won that battle. Now let's go in this one. Science Division report success. Good, we've got tier 3 railguns now. And now we get tier 3 missiles. Great. Fleet action underway. Jeez, we're just doing a flyby of him. He's just instantly dead. Station. Fleet action underway. Oh, did they already surrender? Oh, they surrendered. Nice. Lovely. The Oh, so the planet can choose to surrender now. Oh, that's a new mechanic. That's a neat new mechanic. I like that. Okay. Cool. Once this is taken, which I believe it already is. Beautiful. Cool. All right. I'm going to pause it. I'm going to pause it. All right. With... That being said, and with that being done, we are already well within our second military campaign against the Xenos of this galaxy. Um, we won our first one from the previous episode, which is great. We are starting to really kind of become the powerhouse in our region, if not the powerhouse in the galaxy, considering that the one to our top right is inferior to us in most like military aspects. The only thing they're up with us on is research, which is good. I like building, I believe it was on a comment on a couple videos ago, where it was like, it was hard for somebody to, um, they found it hard to kind of figure out how to build a military, a strong military, in, like the military industrial complex empire, things like that. Like, one tip that I would give is, is to, um, is to build the economy first. You can never have a military without the proper support structure to prop it up, if that makes any sense. And so that's what I'm going for here. And I'm choosing my targets, not just like willy-nilly, I'm choosing my targets specifically for their like military and strategic value. There's a reason why I went over here and claimed these four systems along with this one, so that way I could get another choke point on it, so that way they would have to attack me if it ever came down to it. Right? taking things that are like of military like using the hyperspace lanes to your advantage and stuff like that is really cool um maybe that'll help but anyway i'm gonna end this episode here if you enjoyed it please leave a like let me know what you think of the video and with that being said if you enjoyed it so much please subscribe i would greatly appreciate it and again with that being said i will see all you guys next time bye guys